everybody. So, I went to the store today, and I got some supplements, and I just wanted to show you guys what I picked up. And I'm going to show you what I take, and for those of you who don't know, I'm sorry, this is kind of weird. Um, I don't take any over-the-counter medicine or take any westernized medicine or whatever you want to call it. And the only reason I don't is because it's just not for me. Um, I have a sensitive stomach now. Some I took some antibiotics a long time ago um, in like 2012. And I got really sick after that and I haven't been the same since. So I've had to change my lifestyle so I can feel really good. And instead of NyQuil and Robitussin and Claritin and all those things that I used to really love, I now take these. So I went to the store. I was trying to look for lysine, elderberry, sea moss, the talk. But um, fortunately here in Dominican Republic, I haven't been able to find L-lysine, elderberry, or sea moss. But I bought B12. I bought valerian. I also bought St. John's Wort. And these are things that I bought. Let me see. And some of these have other things in it. Let me check. And ba -ba -bum. yeah. Oh, and for the B12, so you know, if you could see it. See the C word? Try not to get that. See the M word? That's what you want to get. That's the pure authentic. The C is more of like a, a man-made type chemical. It's still effective, but not as strong. So, how do you say this? Spirulina. Does this have anything else? Nope. There's one thing that I got. I had a couple things. Oh, yeah. I got activated charcoal and also sinus support. Now, the sinus support has in it nettle, eyebright, horseradish, elderflower, which is probably the closest thing to elderberry that I might have been able to get. And this is sinus support. So, you can call it holistic or whatever. It's cool. So, what I have previously, this is my medicine cabinet. I don't have, like I said, I don't do the NyQuil, Robertessin, or anything. I'm just going to show you some other things I have, just so you can see what I get into. And these are things that I take for my personal body and my personal needs. This is not going to be for anybody. This one is not really effective. I don't know. My body never muscle tests for that one for some reason. Um, multivitamin for women, omega, these for everybody, yes. Um, this can be for everybody, yes. But if you ever had like maybe Lyme disease or mold issues, these are things that more than like you should be taking. Kelp. Um, I had a probiotic. It's gone now. Magnesium. Apple cider vinegar, which actually has in the pills some other cool things. There's the kelp already in there. Some things you could see. So sometimes you have to... Oh, I got some more of that. And these are things that I had in the past that are probably not good anymore. But, so I remember how I got my healing. And then I have another probiotic that's almost gone. So yeah, that is Medicine Cabinet with Allie. If you have any questions, just let me know. I just want to show you that there is hope. If you are sick, if you're having problems, there are ways to feel good. And this is how I personally feel good. And I, on top of that, I also had to change the way I eat to just natural foods. Anything that's fresh, grown out the ground, less things in a box and bags. And um, yeah, you know, fruits, vegetables. I do still eat meat. And um, I love you. If you have any questions, let me know. You can be free. You can be healthy. You can love your life. You don't have to be in pain. And if you are in pain, it's not normal. You can get it fixed. There's chiropractor, acupuncture, nutrition, and the way you eat is, the, is, is it. That's really it. It sounds simple, right? It, it really is. But... I'm hoping to show the world and teach people, you know, these things. And, and if they work for you, let me know. If you need help, if you have any questions, ask. We will find an answer to your problem, to your pain, whatever you're hurting. 